Bushbelly is the one I told you about. It's a thousand year old wine from Croatia. Usually it's really uh, acidic wine, but they make it a little bit lighter, so more refreshing, mm -hmm. mineral. It has 12% of alcohol. Usually the wines from that region can go to 14 to 16% of alcohol, but you will not feel alcohol on the palate, in the mouth, and on the smell on the mouth. Okay. Mm. <sighs> He's a real life sommelier. sommelier. I want to be friends with him forever. Okay. You can tell what soil what season, mm -hmm. how much alcohol is in it. It's so good. Do you guys want to go to like SOM school? No, it's, it's too much. It's too hard. Dude, but we have our whole lives to live. So should we just move here? Yeah, let's move here. And then let's all aspire to work at this shop? Yes, that sounds good. <laughs> we could just clean the bathrooms. <laughs> so It'll be like a Google hunting story. Yeah, we'll, we'll wash the yeah. glass, wine glasses. And then all of a sudden, they're gonna be doing like some sort of wine tasting thing, and then we're gonna like smell it and then we just like say, Be what like it is. geniuses. And like <laughs> <laughs> okay, and this was from where? That one was from here. So, right on the border with uh, Slovenia and Hungary. Mm -hmm. 15 kilometers from Motivun is a small town in between Pura. For Porich and Pula, it's called Vijinada. They're third generation of the winemakers, so two brothers aged 24 and 25. Right now? Frankly, yeah. They're so <gasps> young. So it's 100% Croatian variety of grape. It only grows in this area, you cannot find it anywhere else, mm -hmm. only in that area here. Compared to the previous one that you tried, uh, this one can be in all different varieties, so it can be really easy to drink, really mm -hmm. heavy, it can be orange wine, unfiltered wine, barrick wine, Malaysia. When I pour it, you will see it has a golden color, color some like honey color, mm -hmm. because it was macerated 24 hours on the air, so it gives them a different taste, different flavor. It will get easier and easier to drink, because tannins will get from, I don't, let's say, full to medium. I've already seen that. So like, oh, well, like. <laughs> Glass. Sorry, go ahead. Uh -huh. yeah. So it becomes easier to drink. Nothing, yeah. Yeah, it is. Uh -huh. Okay, now I can tell the story of. We are on our way to the Croatian airport, Zagreb specifically airport. the Zagreb airport, from this beautiful place called Vinoteca Bernstein, where we made a new friend named Josip. Well, actually, we're going to return the car now, and we just had the best day ever. We're just all really happy because. Joseph made us feel at home in Zagreb and every time we come back to Zagreb we can see our new friend and he can tell us more about all the wines of Croatia and how's that? It's great. And that's all folks. Any so last words? All, folks. We're just sad to be leaving Zagreb but we're excited to go to Amsterdam. And I'm not, I'm happy that I'm not crying. I'm not sad. I'm just happy it happened. I didn't cry because it was over. Because it happened. <laughs> yes. That's Not a new sad. saying. We just arrived at our Airbnb in Amsterdam. Hello. And, <laughs> Hello. And yeah. our Airbnb hosts left us a vase of tulips and some stroop waffles and this meat. But so sweet of them. Now we're gonna go eat dinner. Mm -hmm.